focus. So in a previous video where I showed off the uh, bulwark, um, quite a few people were uh, asking questions about how it worked. Um, so I thought I'd just show you a um, show you basically part of the inside for the focus. There we go. So the magazine will sit in here and I have a um, like a little gear here. Um, and it spins round, if I can move my fingers out of the way, and, sorry about the trucks, it basically takes a dart out, slides it down these rollers, and into the flywheel cage which sits here, and straight out. And it's pretty much as simple as that. Um, the gears are run by a, the tiny um, N20 gear motors, which are the same as the Jupiter motors, um, so Luke from Outer Darts sells them on his website. One thing I didn't really cover, particularly in my first video, was just how easy it is to change the mags. The mags will just slip, slip in the top of the blaster like that, and the catch at the back holds them in place. When they're released, um, there's a spring which pushes the mag up slightly, just to make it even easier to grab. So the mag will just go in, and then you can just change mag by using the second mag flick it out and just slot the new mag straight in and it's one of the easiest mag changes I've ever done. Let's talk FPS. Currently it's too low. It hits about 100 FPS. Um, with I'm using slow motors with hurricane wheels so it's going to be fairly slow, uh, fairly low FPS. Um, I'm wanting to push that up to um, 130-ish by increasing the crush on the cage and um, but I want to keep that still on, on 2S because that's what the setup is set for at the moment. Um, I'm going to be developing a two-stage cage um, with similar setup to Woozy um, so we should see should be able to get Woozy numbers um, from the from the upgraded cage um, and I'll then work for work to get this set up on uh, 3S configuration as well.